Hello everybody, Mike here at Game From Scratch, and quick announcement, Armory 3D is now funded. Thanks to uh, Chris K for the scoop in a YouTube comment earlier. Um, yeah, I've been waiting for this for quite a while, and unfortunately I can't go into a whole lot of detail because even though it is now fully funded, I don't really have a lot to show you. But why should you care about Armory 3D, and why do you care that it's funded? Well, let's start with why you care that it's funded. This is an engine that has been actively under development and then on Patreon, Basically, once they hit their milestone goal of goal of $1,600 per month, they are going to release this fully free, forever open source on the internet. And we are there. So this is now a new open source game engine for us to all um, jump in and play with soon. And that's why this is a short video, because even though they hit their fully funded target, uh, and they reached it by $1, so they may have literally just reached it, it hasn't been open sourced yet. So first off, I'm not going to go into a whole lot of detail, because the second it is over sourced, I'm going to jump into it and cover it in probably great depth here and on Game From Scratch. It's an engine I've had my eye on for quite some time, and I've been waiting for it to get funded. That's when it's going to open up to the masses, and I think this one could be very popular. And its timing is ideal because it is a lot like Blender game engine in many ways. It runs inside of Blender. Now it isn't built on Blender quite as much. It is an independent game engine that just happens to run in Blender and integrate fully with Blender. So you can use Blender to set up everything. Uh, you can do a node-based, <coughs> excuse me, a node-based composition of your game. You can create your levels, etc., directly in Blender. But this is actually um, powered by KHA, K -H -A, a uh, framework from the Hacks uh, programming language. So those two things go together. So basically, Hacks, KHA, and Blender have all been kind of amalgamated together to create this cool all-in-one game engine environment. And it, it's actually uh, able to run on Windows, Linux, Mac OS, HTML5, Android, iOS, PlayStation 4, Xbox One, and the Nintendo Switch. And that is Ka under this behind the scenes providing that functionality. Um, again, I'm not going to go into a whole lot of detail, but essentially it turns Blender into a bonafide game engine. And unlike Blender game engine, it's actually a game engine that's been getting a lot of love and treatment and focus as of late. So it's very cool to see that this has actually uh, made it to the masses. So like I said, once it's out there, I can get my hands on it, I will, and I'll do a more in-depth video here on the channel. So this is really all I'm covering for today. But if you are interested in learning more, I will throw this link down below. This is to the Armory Patreon page, and they've got a couple of videos on their channel basically showing Armory in action. I do recommend, if you've never heard of Armory, to go and check it out. I once said in the past, this is the single most interesting engine I haven't had my hands on yet. I've been waiting for this Kickstarter campaign, or sorry, this uh, Patreon campaign to finish off, and it is finally there. So hopefully this happens soon, and there will be a release very, very very soon. I'll be keeping my eye on his uh, Twitter feed for the announcement. So you can head to the Patreon page. I will link that down below. Also, you can head to armory3d.org. There's a lot of overlap between the content between the two. Uh, basically, it's 100% overlap between the two. But uh, there is a lot of detail available about the game uh, engine, the previous releases that have been made available, uh, etc. They also have a GitHub page with a bit more detail there, as well as, of course, source code that you can jump into. Now, it's not source code that you can easily build or get running, so don't think that we're quite there yet, but I can't wait to see this being a full, fully released, packaged, easy to install, uh, great project for people to jump into, but I will throw all three of those links down below, so if you don't want to wait for me to do a formal video on Armory 3D, all of that information is there. So, uh, first off, congratulations to the Armory team. Uh, it's cool to see another uh, open source option out there and cool to see that it is funded and will continue to remain as an open source project. That's, that's awesome to see. And hopefully this turns out to be another really viable game engine, uh, especially, like I said, uh, with the death of Blender Game Engine. I'll link a video at the very end of this describing that recent uh, action. Um, there really is a place for... Um, the Armory engine even more so than there was before. So uh, some great news. Hope you guys found that interesting. Sorry, I can't go into a whole lot of depth. Like I said, I haven't got my hands on it yet, but I will as soon as I can. All right, talk to you all later. Goodbye.